So, I hope you remember that a long time ago, well, more like a week ago, I did a video on the sabotage of the open house. And, yeah, so the quest with the Soul Riders. So, now I'm going to do the next part of it because Star Stable just released that. Well, not just, they released it a long time ago. So, I'm going to do a video on that now. Where is this? Oh, it's Sunfield Farm, not Yorvik Stables. I always forget that. I think they need an actual Yorvik Stables trailer. I thought it was about to trailer, but it... I thought it was about to pay, but it didn't actually trailer. Oh my goodness. Sunfield Farm. Here we come. Soul Riders, we're gonna save you and kick Sabine out on her bum. <laughs> With the nice music. I love this music. It's so nice. Wait, is that Ash from the Wildwoods? Wow, that's cool. Okay, so here's Alex. Have you been sitting there for a week or have you been taking breaks? Racing really racing really clears my head. So what do you think? Should we sneak into the group of riders? Prepare to infiltrate Sabine's cadre. Interesting. There is one thing I'm a little worried about. If I go near Sabine, I might not be able to control myself. I'd want a zapper. Just a little zap, but I'd want a zapper, alright. Ooh, good. Ooh, good point. I don't see how I, I don't want to see how I'd react if I were to confront her, not after everything she's done. How do you feel about confronting Sabine? I'll do it for the keepers of Aideen. I can do it, she doesn't scare me. It kind of looks like I'm the only one left to do it. Come on, stop giving us pessimistic er options. I'll do it for the keepers of Aideen. Sabine won't stand a chance against you. That we know. That I know for certain. Well, sh well, I don't have any powers. All of you do. Besides, she almost killed me last time with her freaky icicles. Linda's right. Plus, she's so self-involved, she'll never suspect your motives. Good luck, secret agent Rebecca. Wink, wink. Confront Sabine, Sabine and infiltrate her cadre. It just said that last one. This is cool. Uh-huh. Well, 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 look what the horse dragged in. Can't you see I'm busy? It's obvious you're not here to join me. Run along, Rebecca. Yes, of course, I know your name. I know all about you. You look different from last time. Did Star Stable update you and your character? Huh. It's creepy. What brings you to me anyway? Stop torturing those poor riders. Bold of you to show your face around here. Just curious is all. Have you been hitting the gym? Um, have you been hitting the gym? That seems oh. the... Why? You want my workout routine? No chance. Like many things on Eurovic, the secrets of my strength, they're closely guarded. I'm giving these riders an alternative to the sappy saturating clubs that have run rampant over the island. Not everybody's looking to join a squeaky clean friendship bracelet wearing BFF for life club. Of course, the riders have nothing on con in me. They wish. Hmm? What, surprised I'm not keeping things a secret? Don't you think if I wanted to hide something from you and your friends, I would be more subtle? Whoa, you have scars on your face. Wow, that looks kind of pixelated. Oh my goodness, that is so creepy. Well, if you're not going to leave me alone, you might as well put yourself to use. Entertain me, Rebecca. 
You're always riding around with our Zoe Dean loving soul riders, but you will ha but do you have what it takes to reach a level of riding prestige most people only dream of? I think I've done that before. I mean, the Night Feathers are riding prestige. Uh-huh. Show me what you've got. Do what these riders are doing, and demonstrate your skills as a rider to me. Nice, although I kind of wish I had Fancy Darling or Faith. If you impress me enough, I just might challenge you to a race. Now, doesn't that sound like fun? I hope it doesn't ask me to get my starter horse. And anyways, ugh. I need faith for a race against her. I knew you would agree to it. The ever so curious goody two shoes are the easiest people to break. Don't think that's you? Then prove it. No, there won't be any dressage involved. I don't think you've got what it takes. Work your way around this jumping track. Give it all you've got. If you succeed, I might give you a second challenge. Oh, Acacia is better. Acacia is my best jumping horse. Party Princess is gonna die. Come on. Am I gonna have to go back to my home stable? Ah, this is bad. Oh, it gives me a lot of time. This is kind of easy. Nice music, though. Ah, nice. At least I knocked down a couple rails. Oh, wow. That was kind of weird, but also easy. Come on, Sabine. That was easy. Congrats, you made it to the finish line. What, you want a round of applause? It'll take more than that. You're just weird. You passed the first test, but what about this second one? Most of the riders who tried failed this challenge. Will you? Salome will run the poles. Speed won't help you here. I'm... Uh, when I go to Starshine Ranch, I'm really bad at the pole bending. And that's the only old pole bending I've ever done. So, I don't think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna fail this. I'm really good at barrel racing, but not pole bending. Oh, this is kind of easy. Wow, these poles are tall. These poles are really tall. Why would anyone fail this challenge? Like, why? These are a lot of poles though. Although, if somebody did it slowly, they shouldn't fail. I wonder if most people have actually failed this. Or if the Star Stable team is just like saying that to add some horror effect to Sabine. Wow, that was only one minute and 20 seconds. That seemed like much more. Huh, you did it. Maybe those druids taught you a thing or two about riding after all. Yay, Party Princess is level 14 now. I just might max her here. That was just the warm up. This next test, it's the real deal. Listen to Sabine's third test. Ooh, make or break. This is gonna be interesting. Uh -huh. Prove yourself in this. It just might take you seriously. But first, consider something with me for a moment. 
sad, isn't it? This puny spectacle of a festival, 